Homies, what's up? Little Big Robot's back with another video. I'm gonna adjust my mic a little bit here. I'm going to be uh, taking a look at this today. These are, this is a six pack of Dolly figures. Um, this is a line that I've been wanting to try out for a long time called Come For Arts, C-O-M For Arts. They are essentially, um, a kind of like a, I don't want to say uh, they're a figure company. Uh, I'm trying to do, do to, I'm trying to make sure that I call them what they are. They're figures, they're not just dolls or whatever. Nowadays the lines are blurred so much. Um, but I was wanting these for a while, and I was ch keeping an eye on them on um, a Big Bad Toy Store. <clears throat> and by the way, if you like robots, uh, miniature dolls kind of miniature robot stuff be sure to subscribe and trying to get to 4,000 subscriptions before too long so what these are it are a collectible line of figures um, that are sh real strange looking sometimes they have a really cool like a uh, animated stop motiony kind of look to them it's hard to describe you just have to see them I'm gonna open them up and we'll We'll see what we can find here, but essentially they come in these cool containers. Not all of them come in the same kind of container, but I believe they all come in some sort of can like this. These are gotcha based or what you would call like blind box based where you um, you don't know what you're going to get. So anyway, they were on um, Big Bad Toy Store. I kept looking and kept looking. I was like, ah, they're pretty expensive, 30 to 50, usually around 50 bucks. Um... 50 bucks a piece and they finally had them all completely half off and so I was like you know what I'm gonna bite the bullet and go ahead and grab those granted I'd had a little wine so I was a little bit tempted what I'm uh, hoping for here is there's certain characters I want you get there's eight total uh, it comes with six the packaging is really interesting six to eight inch figures um, the, the the there's six initial figs and then there's, I think, two blind box ones. So I have the chance to pull two of the the unique ones. I didn't look too much into it. I just because I didn't want to be disappointed or anything if I didn't get one that I didn't want. But I mean, they're all cool looking. There are definitely there are definitely probably two or three that I really wanted. And I'll tell you what, I will I, when I see. I'm gonna go ahead and just cut that right there. If I get the one I want, I guarantee you'll know it because I will be able to tell you. Um, I don't know why it says 50%, like they're 50% size. Now I have no idea how these open. So let's just, I'm going to put the paperwork over in here. I mean the plastic. I love the packaging. How do you open this stuff? I have no idea. I've never even looked into it. Do you screw it off? I like keeping, this is such a great package, packaging that I want to keep it. So I don't want to, ah, ah, ah. Cut that little thing. Now. Ah, ah. Look at that. Look at that. Ah. Wow. Wow. So far, I love the packaging. What the heck? Whoa. Oh my god. I'm going to might have to do this in a two-parter video. There's so much in here. A little stuck. So, some paperwork. This package is so cool. This this case. Oh, is that who I'm getting? I don't know. Let's see here. So you've got operation manual, which is okay. You get that with a figure, so you need to assemble it all. Put the clothes on there, I guess. Um, I think they come naked. And then I think you need to... Ah! There's the head. I don't remember if this is the one I wanted or not. I mean, they're all cool. They're all cool. I don't know which ones are like a blind box exclusive and which are not. But you can see about the size that the figure is going to be. This is a fantastic looking head. Um, I'm, I'm afraid I might start falling for uh, these kind of art toys a bit. Um, I don't like, I should say art figures, because I don't like the ones that are just a statue. I'm not a statue guy. If I'm going to get a statue, it needs to be something... Particular, or why is it? Oh man, it's like a blow up. What in the hell is this? Oh, is it his boat? 
What is this? What the hell is this? Okay, I'm gonna blow it up. Give me two seconds. Oh my god, this is seriously gonna give me a, a, a head rush. Let's see if I can do it. Okay, I could feel it out a little more, but yeah, it's like a... Um... A... a kayak? Okay, so that that's different so far. So, so far. Um, I got this. A little one of these silicotial things. I'm gonna put this over here like this. Okay, so let's open this and see what we got. I wonder if they're already dressed. I thought you had to dress them yourself. But I'm not sure. I, I love this feeling of pulling one of these tabs. When it comes off like that simple, that easy. Very, very nice. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, so yeah, you don't have to put the clothes on. I thought you had to. Wow. Whoa, this is awesome. Look at the... The... Oh, wow, it's, the joints are nice and tight. Wow, double, of course, double jointed legs. Wow, 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 look at this. Oh, these are so cool. Why did I wait so long to get these? These are just, these are like such my, completely my vibe. This is insane. Look how cool these are. Now, these, are, I think these might have gone on sale because they weren't the most popular line. They were a beach line. Let's see if I can get his head on easily. Um, the other ones were a bar, which of course the bar one I think was my favorite, like characters, people you find in a bar, like uh, bar patrons. Uh, there we go. Oops. Did I not get that on? Oh dear God. It's not getting on. I'll have to get it. I'm going to kill myself. Um, Oh, it is on. Okay. <laughs> so, like, Bar Patrons was the other one that was really popular. They have, like, a post-apocalyptic kind. These look like something you would use in stop motion. These are insane. These are so cool. This one is, at least so far. No positions. He should stand on his own. I have to get him in a good spot there. Then, look at this. What? These are in nuts. Look at that. <laughs> Real, I love how, um, I'm not one to, for completely cartoony characters. What I do love though is stylized characters. And this is extremely stylized, but without being, um, without being like over the top where it just looks like a cartoon. Of course it doesn't look Look at the little, this little buddy here. It doesn't look realistic, but when you're posing it, the way it poses and moves, this this joint is really nice and tight. It has a realistic feel to it. Um, you've got these cool little working latches here. I'm not going to take all that off for now. I might mess with it later. He's got his little straps there, actual printed little piece there. Um, the feet. Rotate, of course, has actual cloth little socks. I'm so glad I didn't have to dress them. I thought we had to dress them ahead of time. So you can do like... Ah, these are just so crazily cool. So I can't get into this. This is gonna, this is gonna bankrupt me. These are so cool. Okay, so but without making the video four hours long, let's go ahead. I'm gonna put him in his, his kayak. He's gonna rest there for now. I want to get some of the other ones open. I don't want to make a 30 minute. Well, it's going to be a while. It's going to be a long video. So let's open. <sighs> you know what? I'm going to have to open them all. I can't get away from it. So you're just going to have to be here for a while. Sorry. So actually, it looks like I don't have to take off all the plastic. I can just take off this stuff at the top, which is cool. I'm going to pause here. I'm going to do that on all of them real quick on the top, and then I can just pop them open. Okay, cut all the plastic off the top so I can just quickly open it so the video doesn't take... 400 days. Now there is, uh, I don't want to see the head. Yeah, I can already see it. There are two or three female characters that I really wanted. So those are, ah, this is one of the ones I wanted. I already saw. Cause I just looked at the picture and, and um, picked out the ones I wanted. So they do come with like a little training card, trading card. So there's her. Um, and she came with, the one I wanted had a surfboard. Look at that. 
<laughs> that is so cool. I don't need the instructions because it's already assembled for me. That that makes me feel good. I thought you had. I thought we had to uh, like literally assemble them and put them together, and I was worried it would take like twelve years to do. So this I'll just cut apart real quick here. <laughs> So this this uh, girl I liked a lot. She had a surfboard. She looked really cool. Did I even cut that? Yes, I did. Um, so I wanted this one. This is definitely one of the ones I wanted. Uh, the first guy was not one of the ones I wanted. So that tells me he might have been one of, the, one of the ones I didn't even notice. So maybe he's one of the ones that's a bonus or something. But I don't know. Let's see here. Oops. Okay, got some of the bits and bobbles out. So, let's assemble the surfboard. Oh, the other way. Look at that. Wow, what's it say? Look at that. <laughs> they just come with a cool little, cool little accessories. The plastic definitely feels like a um, premium kind of plastic. It's kind of like a matte finish. It has a nice matte finish feel to it. Um, so, it's definitely a quality plastic it feels more like a little bit of a statue or like i said it really does feel like a, a stop motion animation figure not that i felt a lot of those but ooh, i love that peeling that off it's so satisfying so let's take her out everything in there and nothing inside the bag so, so. all right let's see if i can get her head on first yeah this one i absolutely loved uh, it's a little hard to get the heads on but once you do well, <laughs> look at her. <laughs> look at her torn jeans. She's got um, distressed jeans. Look at her shoes. Wow. The details on the shoes are fantastic. I love how large the hands are. That's what gives them a really stylized feel is these large, large hands. But also, it, but it doesn't quite creep into super cartoony. Um, if that makes sense, there's a there's a real delicate balance you can you can take, uh, you can you can uh, keep, you know, to keep them from, you know, stepping into the not I don't say uncanny valley because obviously they're not realistic, but into like the world of just mega cartoony. This one's incredible. This is one of the ones I wanted. I guess those are her bracelets. I'll put those on in a moment. So she has her extra hand. Is she doing a heart hand? Oh my God! Look at that. And then she has her surfboard that she stands up next against, like that, holding the surfboard. Look at that, how freaking cool. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Those are so good. This is going to get me in so much trouble. Okay, let's see if we can... No, I don't want to knock her over. Let's set that down for now. Okay. I'm going to go relatively fast because I'm going to sit here and stare at them later and play with them more later. But I just wanted to kind of go through the line and see if I get the ones that I wanted. Um, so far, I've I've gotten one that I definitely wanted was her. I didn't think she would be so perfect though, like her big fat feet. He, I didn't necessarily. No, oh, this is another one I wanted. Yeah, I wish that they didn't um, that they hid the head from you a little bit, the the extra parts. You can kind of tell who you get right away. This was another one of the girls I thought was really really cool. She has a guitar and stuff. Oh man, these are so good. So let's put the bottom back. You get some of her little bits. See, they all come with quite a bit of little stuff. It's really, really cool. Her head. So she's adorable. Again, satisfying. Oh, did it not? Uh-oh, it missed it. Didn't open it though. Oh, well, let's give it one of these. Okay. Zoop. Let's get her out. Oh, she's so cute. Wait, I'm thinking. See, you gotta fill the bag, because I think I left something in the bag. Oh, one of these, that's all it is. Duh. Okay, so first things first, let's open her head. Get it on, take a look at the doll and all the extra stuff. I think you gotta, you, you just kinda gotta push it in there. It doesn't really make a snap sound when you put the head on. But, look at her, she's fantastic. Look at her cool shoes. Wow. What's what I love about them is how easily they stand up. Let 
Those are so ridiculous. Now I'm going to want to start collecting this size, which what would that be? Well, this is like one. Oh man, what size would that be? Does it say on there what scale? Because they're not six inch to eight inch figure. That's not a scale, that's a size. But see, these are buddies. See, they're buddies there. Hello, hello. Set them up. Let's get a good photo. Fantastic. Fantastic. Look, she's got a, this one's got a dress on. Um, I don't know if you can swap clothes and stuff, but it looks like it fits them pretty tightly. I'm betting that you could pull off the hands and, and get everything off there, but I'm going to leave it how they're designed, but I love her face. Her neck is a little crooked. You see that? I got to get that. I'll straighten that out later. But see how large the hands are compared to the head? It gives them a cartoony, a youthful kind of, you know, like almost like a kid. But <laughs> now look at her and her parts. See, what I like to is not all of them have a large, uh, a large thing. Some of them have like the the kayak, and some of them have just more of small. In other words, you, the amount of plastic you get with each seems to be about the same. You know what I mean? It would it would feel unfair if she, if this one got a giant surfboard and this one got nothing. You know, so oop. so there's her guitar. Oh my gosh, look. Real little strings. Wow. Wowie zowie. That is insane. And what is this? Um, a paddle for a paddle boat or something? What does she have stickers for? Wow, I'm going to have to figure all these out. I'm going to have to check all these out. These are so much to look at. Little bracelets. Little, they each have a little character. Very, very cute. Okay. So let's... I'm going to put all the extra stuff to the side for now. Uh, let's scoot her off. And before I do the other three... Let's scoot these up a little bit. I think I need to stop here and grab something. I'll be right back. Okay, so back... Let's do these other three because I went, I had to go and grab something, um, grab a drink and uh, grab my inhaler real quick. And the whole time I was thinking how excited I was to open the rest of these. This is, these are insanely cool. I can't tell you how much um, I like the feel of the plastic. It's like a matte finish plastic, similar to a few weeks ago I did um, the robot from Invincible, and his plastic was very, very, just very tactile -y. Let's see here. Similar to this. Now look at this. So this is robot from Invincible, the cartoon you might know. I'm going to go ahead and take her guitar for now. Put her arm down. So... That, her skin has this amazing feel that Robot has. It's, it's like a, it's a modern, a little bit more um, luxurious um, toy plastic, I guess. It must be more expensive or it's just done in a different way. Maybe it's coated or something, but it has this like... Just wonderful satiny feeling. I'm gonna go ahead and put robot aside because he is not in my beach figure. So there was so far I've got two of the ones I wanted. I wanted the two ladies. I wish see, I think I just saw that I got another one. Well, it's fine, it's fine. Yes. Okay, so I got so far I've gotten the three I wanted to do. I wanted all the ladies in the show in the uh, series. I love the displays too, the little cans. Um, she doesn't. She only has a paddle and a little and a beach ball. I thought she came with something else. Again, a very satisfying part that little tab. And so um, I'm I'm completely happy with what I got so far. Then, you know they they there's eight of them or whatever, and they make it sound <clears throat> they make it sound like you have a chance of getting some, but not all. You know I'm paranoid about that stupid silica gel packet in there is making me paranoid that I'm not getting everything out of the package. It's pretty easy to tear this plastic, so. And get her head on first. The clothes are really, they're like, 
they look like little, you know, they have a little stitching. Ah, oh, she's so cool. Wow. Little skinny chicken legs. It's weird when you first are opening them, when you're first manipulating this, the joints, they definitely feel really tight, but not too tight. And they just are just, just fun to handle. Look at her feet. These are killer. Oh, did I get a smudge? I don't care. That's fine. Look at this. It's kind of interesting. It has a rotation thing right here. So you see that little line there? It's an actual additional section of rotation. That's interesting. Again, each shoe has its own tread. It's got like these brand names on their clothes that I've never heard of. Maybe there's something. I don't know. Her face is absolutely adorable. Really? What's that say? Poo poo. Come for Arts. Um, I think Come for Arts is the company who makes them. I don't know where they come from, where they're based. So she is a volleyball player, I think is her vibe. Um, and has, I'm sorry, they are. I don't know if it's a she or not. So what we're going to do, let me see her little volleyball. <laughs> so you could have her sir, having them. Serving them up like that. Let's see if we can have just have a, a basic holding thing like a Wilson. Oh my god, look at that! <laughs> ah, these are fantastic. Little punk, little punk rock um, birdie. Now, I don't know why this. What are, the, what are these? These are like a. I wonder if it's like almost like a build a figure or or are you is this a paddle for the boat? I'm not 100% sure what is what. But you can see just how well they all go together. The colors, they have these kind of muted colors. That's kind of a hallmark of their of their line, I think. These like muted colors. Um but they're not they're bright. You know, they're, they're attractive colors, but they're not um, super bright and like pastel. I mean, um, what's it called? Like, you know, like fluorescent. They're very understated colors. And it gives it all like a, a you're like, like I said, like you're holding something from an animated movie, like a stop motion movie. Oh, did I get a duo? Oh, no. No, actually, that's different. That is different. Whoa, cool. Similar shoes. Who is this one? I don't remember which one has shoes like that. I didn't look too closely because I didn't want to spoil anything. Oh, this is a cool one. Whoa, he's got a cool... Look at his backpack. What? Oh, no way. No way. You can put his pet in the backpack. Where's his head? Is it already on there? Oh, satisfying terror. Okay, let's hopefully his head's already on there. Okay, his head is already on there. The shoes were not. Okay, that's cool. Scared me for a second. They've got plastic around them probably to protect it in the package, I'm betting. Oh, man. As soon as you open them, you get this kind of like satisfying... There's a tightness there to the joints. You can hear it. It's just such a satisfying thing. Cool shorts. So let's get his shoes on. Again, I'm cutting these open when I can just pull them. They don't. So his shoes are similar to hers, but closer. The 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 uh, straps are closer together. I kind of like that they had him his head already on and not his shoes to get him in the package, I guess. But maybe each, each one's different for some reason. To make sure I get it all right. Let's see. Ah. Oh no. Ah. Ooh, that's a nice sound. You kind of just got to be confident and just do it, or it will never go on. Let's look at this. Okay, so uh, second dude I got. At least I think it's a dude. If I'm wrong, correct me. I love the expressive faces. We've got like a goatee. The clothes, of course, are really, really cool. Love summer. Like he loves summer or the summer of love? I'm not sure what he means. What they mean here, okay? The, the little I love that they have the little, str you know, the little strings for tying up your 
drawers, shorts, swimming trunks, whatever you want to call them. Oh, he's so, so cool looking. <laughs> I, I mean, I, I guess I could see why people would, these would probably maybe sell the least or some of the least because they're not space age or, you know, um, and to be fair, oh shoot, to be fair, I would have preferred the bar people or the, the post, the, uh, post-apocalyptic kind of ones, but those, it's been done. It's been done. I'm, I'm really, I kind of enjoying the vibe of just standard people on the street you know what I mean? Like just people walking down the street or on the beach or whatever. Let's do this for now. I'm just, okay. Because not everything has to be, you know, spaceships and laser guns all the time. So let's, what I'm really, really excited to do here is put his pet inside the backpack. And I want to say the pet that goes in the backpack is going to be, first let's assemble the back. Look at this. You know these things where you put your cat? I don't think it's for his dog. I think it's for his penguin. Holy moly. The, I think the dog actually could go in there. Look at that. Look at that. That is so great. And what's cool is I bet it's pretty easy to stretch his arms out. One arm in here. Like that. Stretch this arm out. This might be a little harder. Let's see. Can we do like a, a real human would do where you can bend? Look at that. We can because he has such good movement there. On, oh, and I'd have to tighten the straps for sure. So you'd have to tighten them using the actual little straps here, which I'll, I'll do in a little bit. But look, he's like walking around with his pet on his back. If that's not ridiculous, I don't know what is. That is so cool. So you could be like, hey, what's going on? I got my pet. Okay, so his his accessory is one of my favorites, the backpack. That's fantastic. I really like the surfboard though. The pet he gets. Again, cute little pets is not my, not my favorite thing. I actually prefer the duckies. No, that's her ducky, not his. Oh, and he has some sunglasses. Is that what that is? And some, a whistle. Oh, he's like a lifeguard. So he's got a whistle, goes around his neck, and a bracelet. They all come with some sort of bracelet, which is really cool. I don't want to get them too mixed up, but I'm kind of already there. Lifeguard whistle. Ooh! Look, they even put the sunglasses in like a little case to help protect them. That was a really nice touch. I mean, because you're paying average price, I think, a normal price for these, I think, is 50 bucks. Um, so just bear that in mind. I got them for, I think, 30. <laughs> oh my God. Why did I wait so long on getting these? Which one did I have not opened? Wait. So let's take a look. Get them all in the shot. These are so freaking adorable, but also just cool. Like, that's something else. I've never done really, I guess you wouldn't call them art toys. These are dolls, action figures, whatever. But I've never really done the kind of, you know, collectible ones. I don't like the ones, like I said, that are just a static, just a, are just a statue. I'm not a statue, guys. Look at that. I didn't get a repeat. So these are all unique. That was what I was wanting to see. I don't know which one this is. I don't remember which one. Oh, the flip-flop one. I mean, the swimming one, yes. Okay, so let's do this. Okay, this one should be a swimmer. Uh, you know, with like, um, flip, uh, what are these called? Uh, darn it. Swimming feet. What are those called? Why am I blanking on that name? It's a real common thing that people use. Flippers? Are they called flippers? So she has flippers and she's like a deep sea person, I guess. Okay, so let's get her out. She has a stick thingy. Not sure what this is. I wonder if the, ah! I guess it is a, um, yeah, it looks like she has the pole. Oh, this is kind of like a build a figure in a way. She has the pole for the, for the, um, for these things. So now 
what you have is a proper paddle for the uh, kayak guy person. So let's put that out there with him. There's his thing. Here's her pup, baby thing. What is this? Pet? I like the pets a lot. She's got a peace hand. Uh, I mean, look at the how simple of a design that is. How simple of a cast and a and a and a uh, mold. You know, a shape. They they. I don't know how they build these. It's built with this kind of softish plastic. It gives a little bit. But and it's just got a simple line for the for the hand there. But that tells you everything you need to know. You don't need much more than that. I, I wish toy companies would remember that. You don't have to put so much into detail as much. It put more into character, not so much into detail, if you can. Um, in action figures and robots and toys and stuff that I get all the time, they, people are obsessed with how much of a detail, you know, you know, something has and how detailed it is on the surface, but. Sometimes they lack completely lack character. So with these, it's a good. These are these are hard to get out. Oh my gosh, these are a perfect example of how character allows your brain to fill into details. So you don't necessarily. Oh, this is like a weird sticky tape. What did they do here? Focus, please. Thank you. This is not good. I hope it doesn't pull the paint, or I'm going to be PO'd because I really wanted this one. I, so far, I've gotten everyone I wanted. I don't know which one is missing. There's two extras. I have to look them up. But you see how, like, robot here? There's not much detail going on here. It, it's really just plain old. So, yeah, he could use a wash or whatever, but with something like these, everything, I mean, granted, they have real cloth, but every, your brain just fills in every little detail. It's, you, toy companies don't have to go crazy and you know, spend all their research and stuff on little wires and stuff as much as they need to make a great character. When you make a great character, people will respond to it. Um, these are all obviously great characters. I mean, it really makes me want to see the bar, the bar patrons ones. I haven't seen those yet. Let's see here. I'm trying to get this. Look at this. It's like a sticky. Come for it. If you see this, why did you do this? I mean, maybe it's protecting of the none, of the, none of the paint got ripped off, so that's good. Okay, so when you're doing the, the feet, I've discovered this with other action figures. When you have a cloth like this, you're pushing and pulling, it's, it's giving you a lot of, so you try to try to get it on the plastic if you can, but you just kind of got to go for it. Am I getting the right feet, though? Is there a left and a right? I think there is. Okay, so let's see if I can listen for that snap. Ah! This is going to be so hard, oh my god. I'm gonna see if I can do it. I'm gonna do it off camera real quick. Oh my god. I'm, I'm breaking a sweat trying to do this. Oh my god. I'm gonna break her. I don't wanna break my flip flop uh, swimming person. Uh, okay, I'm gonna try and grab it here to get an actual grip. I wonder if it'd be easier to, no. Okay, so let's try it again, off camera. Ready? Uh, uh. Oh God, that was scary. I was afraid I was gonna break her. Yes. Okay. Froggy girl, scaring the hell out of me. Nope, oh, let's get her head on. Sorry, I'm off camera right now, but. Okay. <laughs> oh, look at her, she's got like the diving pack. Oh, she's ridiculous. I love her colors. Look at this one. <laughs> what a cool character. Look at that. She is just ridiculous. Stands easy because of her flip-flops. You've got a couple bracelets. Oh, you know what? It's like a diving watch. You know, like a, a smart watch or something she can dive with. Because remember, you gotta you got to watch your air when you're going down. Real straps in the back of her thing. So... They are, they're putting real tiny little straps. <clears throat> Am I, is that it? One, two, three, four, five. Wow. So I'm going to have to say accessories. I really, I'm going to have to adjust this, but I, this guy's pet thing, this is ridiculously cool. As a matter of fact, it matches her dress. So it'd be cool for her to have that. And for him to have the surfboard, I think, because he's a summer beach guy. And actually, that makes a ton of sense. 
And what I'm going to do, let's see if I can get it off of him. Because although it's his toy, I wonder if it's meant to be mixed, mixed and matched like that. Maybe it was meant for her, I don't know. So I'm going to take off his toy. Let's put his sunglasses back on because his sunglasses are really cool. They're actually yellow tinted. They fit pretty tightly. That's pretty neat. So I think he should have the surfboard. Sit him right there for now. And she should have the backpack with the, dog, with the pet in it. But I wonder how you do the little straps. I'm sure you do them just like you would in real life, like that. Yep. Take the top one, pull it down, tighten it up. See, is that, oh, let me do it, put it on her first. I don't want to tighten it yet. So I'm gonna put it around her like that. Put it on her other arm in here. You can fold the arm in half because it has that great movability. I might have to loosen the strap again. Yeah, I shouldn't have tightened it at all, but that's cool. Okay, so I got that on. Let's put her arm down. Let's put this down here. Put these, let's hold her shirt down a bit. Actually, would I go the opposite? How do you do this? I can't remember. You go this way to tighten. Scoot swimming girl back. Volleyball person back. Uh, surfboard person back. Do you go... Huh? How do you tighten these? Is that, is that loosening it? No, that's tightening, I think. You know what we might be able to do? Let's say, no, I was going to say she could maybe have her thumbs holding it tighter. Mm, I'll have to mess with that, but see how it matches her dress a little bit better? That's kind of more her, her thing. So that can kind of hold it on at least for now. So you've got her. Put that up here, you can imagine. And I think you could probably put, fit the whole dog in there. But if you needed to, you could also... Well, anyway, I don't want to take it off completely. You could um, put one of the grabby hands. She has one of her grabby hands in here somewhere, probably. And maybe holding the strap, like holding, picking it up. Actually picking it up. <laughs> oh, man, these are fantastic. I don't know which is my favorite. I, I like her a lot. Um... I like these two a lot. I love the volleyball girl. They all have something cool. This guy seems really casual, but he came with this cool boat, which I think is funny. So my favorites, I'm guessing, I'm gonna thank are probably these two here. I just think they look, they just look really, really cool. I love their big chunky shoes. Kind of got nerdy. Her pants are a little too large. It's just, but they're beach worn. Uh, what a great line. What a, what a fantastic. This was a great deal. I'm glad I picked this up. Um, uh, unfortunately, I didn't uh, get any of the other kind yet, but I'm keeping an eye out when those things go on sale. If they do go on sale, I'm grabbing them. Even what are they worth it? Question is, are they worth it at the current sell? You know, current price they normally ask. I'm gonna say yeah because you are getting a, not just an art figure, but an actual. Um, you know, it's it's different than something like a one of these. These this is like thirty bucks, which really wasn't too far off of this. But we have so many robots and stuff, in, which is my thing, but we have so many robots and action figures and stuff in my collection that I really wanted to get into something different. And so although I could have waited or checked for the like the bar patron ones, I thought that this kind of not only was it on sale, but it kind of forced me to try something that was closer to a fashion doll. My wife is in fashion dolls. You might see her dolls reviewed on my channel, but these are different. It's like it's something you'd you would put in a stop motion movie. Just incredible looking. I love. I so I've got to sit here now, clean this up, put all their bracelets and stuff on. Look at this. She's got her own real strings on the ukulele. That is so cool. Like it's just worth it for the little great little details you get. But anyway, I thought y'all might like a look at some of those. I'm in love. I think they're fantastic. I can't wait to get more of these. Good job, Comforts. They look great. Have a good one, everybody. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.